What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Take a Road Trip. I'm your host Charles McCary and we are outside man. Summertime is here and it's time to do some exploring. Seeing what the natural state has to offer. Today we're hitting up three different state parks right here nestled along the Black River. We've got Davidsonville, we've got uh, Lake Charles, and we've got Powhatan State Parks. I'm ready to go see what they have to offer. First up, we're traveling to Davidsonville Historic State Park in Pocahontas. This state park is on the location of the former town of Davidsonville, the home of Arkansas's first post office. The town was an important centerpiece of Northeast Arkansas, but was abandoned in the 1930s. The park now includes ghost structures that represent the buildings that were located on the town square in this important piece of Arkansas history. So we're here at Davidsonville Historic Park outside of Pocahontas, and I caught up with two of my friends here. We've got Tiffany and Caroline uh, from Shadrack's Coffee. How are you guys doing today? Doing great. Thanks for having us. It's great weather out here today. Yes, Good. beautiful. Uh, so we're outside. We, we need to figure out what we need to do out here today. Have you ever been here? I have. It's been a little while, but I have been here, so I think I can show us around a little bit. I, like, I yeah. like the sound of that. So what's your favorite thing to do here at Davidsonville? Just hiking around, being outside, enjoying nature. It's super quiet here. We were just talking about that before. So just being outside and enjoying the quiet is my, my favorite part. Okay. Um, you said, now, before you told me you camped here before. Yes. So we talk did. about the camping sites. What did you? What was your favorite part about the camping sites? Um, it's great. It's very private. It was um, the ba bathrooms are super clean. So we had a great time when we were here. I like it. Now we're here at the visitor center. I'm excited to go inside and check out what they have. Are you guys ready to go? Yeah, oh, let's yeah. go. Let's do it. Yeah. Now Davidsonville has all your typical park activities with fishing, pedal boats, hiking trails, and a visitor center that gives you all the information you need to know about Davidsonville's history. Camping is also available year round for tents, campers, and RVs. But the main attraction is the ghost structures. Make sure to check out these unique pieces of architecture when you make your visit. These are some amazing buildings, structures that we've seen today. I still can't believe how big this place yeah, is. I know, it's very impressive. But I have to hit the road, ladies. I've got another place I've got to go to. Please tell everybody how they get it, can get in contact with you and every and follow you guys on social. Yes, definitely follow us on social media. We have Shadrach's Coffee Facebook, Instagram, and TikToks. You can also go to our website and subscribe to our newsletter, our email newsletter, so that you don't miss all the new things that we have coming. So we've got lots of ways to stay in contact. All right, man. I appreciate you guys hanging out with me today. On to the next one. made our way to Lake Charles State Park, and I must say, I'm a fan. Lake Charles, Charles, it just works together. Let's go check out and see what this park has to offer. Lake Charles State Park features a 645 acre lake, chock full of bass, catfish, crappie, and more. If you like to fish, this is your dream destination. There's so much more to do than fish, though. You can take your boat out on the water, visit the park's nature center, and explore their four hiking trails that wind around the lake. Lake Charles is also open to swimming, so you can cool off in the water before heading back to your campsite to roast marshmallows. Lake Charles is open year round, so make sure to add this state park to your road trip itinerary. And the final stop on our adventure takes us to Powhatan Historic State Park in Lawrence County. This state park is an adventure back in time as there are several buildings still standing from when they were built in the 19th century, including the historic courthouse that is now home to the park's visitor center and is on the National Register of Historic Places. All right, guys, so now we're in Powhatan at the Historic State Park, and I caught up with my friend Haley from hey, First Security Bank. How's everything going? It's going great. Dude, I'm so excited to be in this courtroom right now. This is like the original courtroom. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's so Have great. you ever been to the state park? No, and when I drove up, I was shocked, honestly. Gorgeous. Uh, outside, just pulling up and seeing like the the old brick and everything like that. It was But it looks cool. new. They've done right. such a great job of preserving it. Yeah. So, question. Let's hear it. Do you think you could have lived back in like the 19th century, around this time oh, of this man. building was built? Everything was done so beautifully at the time, so I want to say yes, but I think I like all of the new age stuff That's, a little I, too much. So I, not like no Netflix, oh, no yeah. video games. Like it was just I like Netflix for me. Exactly. Yeah, video games for me. Sure. <laughs> but I'm excited to go see everything else they have to Absolutely. offer. Absolutely. You ready to go? Let's go. Let's do it. Alongside the historic courthouse, there are several other buildings to check out. The Ficklin and Bowden House, the jail, the schoolhouse, and the commercial building are all located on the park's property. 
And in 2011, the Northeast Arkansas Regional Archives were built to house all the records that the courthouse kept track of. You can explore the park on your own or you can schedule a guided tour. But unfortunately now we have to say bye to Haley. Sad day. It's a sad day, man, but it was an awesome day. It really was. I had Thanks so much fun with you today. Yes. Uh, please tell everybody about First Security Bank. Absolutely. So I am with First Security Bank. If you guys ever want more information about our banking services, visit us online at fsbank.com, Facebook, Instagram, however you want to reach us, we'll be there. Thank you so much for coming out today. Thanks for having me. Guys, I had so much fun today learning so much about these three state parks that are right here along the Black River. Uh, thank you so much to our sponsors, Shad Racks and First Security Bank for coming to hang out with us today. If you guys want to see more of these amazing trips that we've done, head over to our website, kit.com slash road trip. I'll talk to you guys in the next one.